<laughs> we're just. Oh, wait, then. Hold on, we can't There's start one more yet. Picture. No I promise I'm done. I understand. This is, uh, like, this is the best case ever. Oh, this is a big day for the cat. <laughs> Hey, this piece is called Doggy Bunny. Yeah. <laughs> Here we go. This is my life now. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, Welcome to the second to last episode of Let's Write with a Plan. Before we premiere the fully recorded and mixed version of our piece, Doggy Fun, I Love You Doggy, I wanted to show you some footage of the rehearsal I had with the string quartet that recorded the piece. These guys know how to write for strings a lot better than I do, and they know every little detail about playing the instruments because they've been playing these things their whole lives. Are you slurring the last beat of 106? 106. The, the 16th notes? Uh, I'm playing. I'm playing the first two. Okay. Oh, oh, actually, so I'm separating the last beat completely. I just have two, oh, the really? two sixteen notes that you have together. Right. I was right. learning, but I don't have to. Yeah. I didn't realize you had those separate. Yeah. Uh, I mean. I can't slow them because they're the same note. Exactly. Yeah. Sure. One, two, three, one. There's some talk about the slurs being kind of extraneous, and then there's a total lack of slurs everywhere else, and that's a little vague. Mm -hmm. um, do you see any like immediate like th things that were, are awkward or issues with just how it's presented, that or things that could be better? At first, it reads a little confusing. It doesn't read confusing now because I've already separated everything out, but yeah. it reads a little bit like I, something might change in here mm -hmm. you know, right. the whole time. So when you're first reading it down. You're constantly on it. Oh, I see. Yeah. <laughs> As to yeah. what, what something might change. And that's a that's an interesting point about the psychology of that section because it's supposed to be so relaxed and flowing. And if you guys are on edge the whole time, it's gonna sound like P. Yeah. Oh, and it, you that's know, what so, I needed to do. Uh, <laughs> for B, yeah. instead of doing accents, you might want to do tomatoes. Oh, that might like go the flat line more. Thing? Yeah, because that mm. that'll feel more like a push instead of like oh, a yeah. like a fast bow instead sort of, of thing. Yeah. yeah. Like just like a press into yeah, the string exactly. a little bit. Measure 67, 68, 69. Um, I, we all have a sports sound on the last beat, right? Uh, yeah. Do you want there to be like a, um, like a pause before we go uh, into 70, or do you want it to go right into so um, without like? Clip, right? So what? like uh, a pause, like as in without changing the rhythm. No, not like a pause. Like a little, sorry, like a yeah, without changing the rhythm, like a, but like a space. rest mark. Mm -hmm. okay. yeah, like instead of like. Cool. Yeah, I think it'd be cool with a little breath. It's like That's a little a really rest mark. Point. Yeah. matter to you in 49 because um, those also are a little bit yeah I mean this, I'm not like a, a slur expert so they're not that important like I think smoothness just general, smoothness yeah. uh, over slurs there's just one that yeah well let's just smoothness try over again. slurs also, yeah just well said yeah. <laughs> Splashier and splashier, and taking make, taking away more and more attention until you get to the big climax of those chords. Uh -huh. There's a part of me though that kind of wants to try like what Ben was saying in the second option, like off the string, because it might be really contrasting to what Chris is doing. It brings up the heel. Yeah, like that. Well, let's hear it then. Can we just try it. I definitely can't predict <laughs> how it's gonna feel. Till this is F. E. 
E. E, yeah, E with the hemiolus. Alright, yeah. one, two, three, four. To be a little dirty here. Okay. Like a, like a, like a big wailing Russian violin thing. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, like that. Uh -huh. okay. That should be like the subtitle. <laughs> like, I love you. No. I love you, doggy. A little bit. Better. A little dirty. Is there a way to play F sharp on two strings? Um, at the same yeah. time? Yes. Yeah, where do you have that? Uh, those F sharps, F sharp, A, 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 F sharp, A, A, F sharp, A, 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 F sharp, after F. You mean octave F sharps, right? What's that? Octave F sharps, not unison. Unison. Oh, unison. Poof. Wait, wait, wait. Where? Poof. How does that work? Yes. Oh, God. I just wish it was a uh, open string, but it really can't. I could throw in the A under it. Yeah, that's oh, that good. Sounds yeah, that. <laughs> The hen, it goes, it goes. The rooster. Uh, uh, got it. <laughs> and that's the hen. <laughs> I can't believe how many people think that roosters go cock a doodle doo. It's actually the hens doing cock a doodle doo, and nobody gives them enough respect. What? I don't know. It's not. Wait, no, it's what? Not. what? What? Just now that I've said a thing that's not true, everyone's mad. <laughs> Forty-five up to uh, one fifty-eight or <laughs> yes. so. Yeah. Everyone C at the top of those lines. I mean A at the top uh -huh. of those lines. It would be cool if we played those as harmonics. This. Oh yeah. can do it. Yeah. Anna and I can do it. Or you can like... No, but that's the same one. It's kind of like the end of the Oh, uh, right. Yeah. Hey, you, right. I don't have... Have... I don't, we don't have one lower than this. Well, that's lame. <laughs> what about the... No, yeah, you're right. Is this harmonicsable? Um, let's see. <laughs> I could play. Yeah, I think that would be good. I mean, and I could do. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. that's really nice. That's oh, cool. 